what is the best ROI for a social media campaign? When it comes to ROI, return on investment, we're used to analyzing a data set of revenue minus expenses. Ultimately, the difference between how much we spend and how much we earn is what we're usually most concerned about. But the real value from social media marketing can and should be viewed differently. Unless you are only selling one product and not offering yourself as a brand, you should be utilizing social media to help build value for your customers. Lifetime value, referral value, influence value, or even knowledge value are all important. One that's really often overlooked is the informational component, or think of it as market research value. So for example, if you have a new product that's coming up, you might be looking for beta testers. Sites like LinkedIn, Meta, Twitter, Reddit, and other social media platforms can be ideal places to ask for new testers and get feedback that's of high value. How you put a dollar amount on that value is not what you should be asking because the ROI can't be measured in dollars. We do know from market research that some of the most consistently tracked metrics for social media marketing are followers gained and engagement increased. The reason is because these metrics have long-term value and that is potentially difficult to measure after just one temporary campaign. When we look at our social media, we are more focused on building top of mind recall and consistent brand awareness for our followers than what we are earning in revenue from them. So what's the best ROI for your social media campaigns? We'd say that depends on what you value. But if you would like us to help you build your social media engagement, we do offer services that can help. So check us out at bruceclay.com today.